and welcome to Dialogues. I'm Roshni Dhar. Let's look at today's top health news. Over 1,000 Indian medical students evacuated from war-torn Ukraine in 2021 have resumed their studies after Uzbekistan allowed them to transfer. The Indian embassy in Ukraine contacted the Samarkand State Medical University in Uzbekistan to inquire about the feasibility of affected students seeking transfers. To bring back stranded Indians in Ukraine, the Indian government initiated Operation Ganga. According to official reports, a considerable number of Indian nationals were successfully evacuated to through this initiative. Approximately 19,000 Indian students were enrolled in Eurekian universities at the onset of the Russian invasion in February 2021. Are you also aspiring to excel in medical journalism and delve into the intricacies of health and medical reporting? Explore our comprehensive course on medical and health journalism available at the Medical Dialogues Academy. Learn from industry experts who possess in-depth knowledge and experience in this field. For further details, scan the QR code provided or access the link in the description box below. A medical student, Amit, originally from Bigu Sarai in Bihar, was part of the evacuation from Ukraine, experiencing one night in a Ukrainian basement during the Russian attack. Another student, Divyansh from Meerut, attending the same university, highlighted the significance of English as the medium of instruction in Ukrainian universities, a feature not universally available. He noted the comparable quality of life between Ukraine and Samarkand, but emphasized a heightened sense of safety in the latter. That's all for today. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for more updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe and press the bell icon.